All right. Good morning, Cleveland Chargers. I am here in Mrs. Rhodes' room. Say good morning. Good morning. And at Cleveland, we are going to try today to be respectful, respectful responsible, responsible, safe, and ready to learn. learn. Nice job, kindergarten. All right. Today for Black History Month, I am highlighting Barack Obama. Raise your hand in this class if you've heard of Barack Obama. He was a president of the United States. He was our first, at, well, kind of African-American president. And I'm going to just read a little bit about Barack Obama today. Let's see. Barack Obama is an inspiration to many people. He is the first African-American to become president of the United States. Obama's story proves that any child from any background can become president. When Obama ran for president in 2008, many people said that he was too young and too unknown to win. Some people claimed that the American people were not ready to pick an African-American as their leader. However, Obama believed in both himself and the American people. Obama's hopeful plans for change in America inspires voters. He won the presidential election on November 4th, 2008. So what was Barack Obama? He became... The president. the president. Awesome. Obama's parents met while they were students at the University of Iowa. Obama's mother, Ann Dunham, was born in Kansas. His father, also named Barack Obama, came from Kenya. The pair came from different worlds, and they were interested in each other's lives. In time, Obama's parents fell in love and got married. On August 4th, 1961, young Barack Obama was born. Sadly, Barack's parents did get divorced when he was a young child. At first, Barack lived with his mother and grandparents in Hawaii. Later, Barack and his mother, who had gotten married, moved to Indonesia. This is where Barack's half-sister, Maya, was born. See his family? All right. There is way more about Barack Obama in here. He has a very busy life. He has two daughters. This is a picture of his family. Michelle Obama is his wife, and I'll highlight her later in the month. She has a really good book, too. We also have this book. It's called Barack Obama, Son of Promise, Child of Hope, that talks a lot more about his childhood. So if you are interested in learning more about Barack Obama, we can check out books about him in the library. Awesome. All right, Cleveland Chargers, we are going to stand up now, face the flag, and we are going to say... The pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, my nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. Outstanding Cleveland Chargers today. We are going to work hard to be respectful, responsible, safe, and ready to learn. And if nobody else tells you today, I love you all. Let's have a great day. You guys